What does delusionally, delusionally optimism look like? It's firmly maintained despite what is generally accepted and is the real reality. Characterized as someone with a mental disorder. That's me. This is what excelled me throughout my sales career. Not wasting my time, not wasting an ounce of effort from customers to my own employees of people who were negative, pessimistic, and could not think past themselves. Sounds like reality. Literally ill at pessimism, limited mindset. Now picture that in sales. I'm selling a customer, knock, knock. Oh, I'm not interested. No, no, of course, I'm not here to bother. No, I'm super busy. Oh, no, don't worry, I'm super busy too. I'm just here real quick because I helped so and so and so and so and I'm just doing this product and blah. Yeah, I'm not interested in buying anything. Oh, totally agree. I hate buying stuff, trust me. Totally know how you feel. Johnson said the same thing. What they found was that this actually helps them because of this and this and this. It's so amazing, so amazing. I'm not hearing anything negative. I'm not hearing objection. Delusional. Do you see it? I cannot hear it. I cannot see it. I cannot digest it. It doesn't digest. You're saying all these objections. You're saying all these negative things. It doesn't absorb. It just, it, I can't hear it. And that's why I crushed it in sale. And that's the real reason I reached financial independence in my 20s. Crushed it in sales because of my delusion. Took that money, put it into real estate. Because when I was a little boy, someone said the quickest way to become a millionaire is real estate. I found out after the fact, holy crap, I'm set for life. That is what I'm trying to show you people. I mentor people. I hold masterminds. I do all the things that I paid to do to reach this mindset. Now you might ask, what if something in reality really does happen? The fender benders I show you with the RV stuff, personal tragedy, death. I take it, I store it, put it away. And there's some philosophical reasons that make me invincible, which I won't get into right now.